everyone. <laughs> wow, what a great energy in this room. What a great energy uh, these days. Um, for us, it was such an incredible opportunity to, to contribute with organizing this conference. Uh, we are really, really happy to hear uh, Gabriel that uh, he lobbied uh, the, the TDF to really choose us and bring Bucharest uh, on the uh, LibreOffice map. So we are really, really happy and thankful for, for this opportunity. Of course, it was not an easy journey. I will tell you a little bit uh, uh, in, uh, in the next slides um, about it. Um, but yeah, I would like to start with thank you. Um, I'm Veronica Ruxanda. Um, in my uh, main life, I'm a mother of Anastasia. She's uh, a really strong-willed uh, young uh, daughter, uh, five years old, and we are struggling with kindergarten currently. So if you see me a little bit down, I'm wondering if she's like still crying. <laughs> but she's going to be fine, yeah. So, um, I'm with One and One since 2006 for 14 years. Um, I worked with One and One in different positions. Uh, started from development, QA, uh, and then uh, occupying different leadership positions in uh, all our segments. Uh, Roberto is going to tell you about our company and you know, he'll can tell you about the, the segments we are working in. So I was a leader in the domains business, in the hosting area, um, and currently I'm working for uh, WebDE, GMX, and Mail.com. Um, and we are happy to uh, develop seven of the products of, uh, of Mail and Media uh, with uh, full ownership here in the team uh, in Bucharest. So I will uh, pass the microphone with, uh, to Roberto. Thank you, Vera. So. I'm Roberto. I'm uh, working with One and One since 2014. Before that, I was working for a French company, but I was I'm working with open source since the beginning, since I started. First with Eclipse, uh, and then LibreOffice, WordPress, and so on. In the company, in One and One, uh, I had different roles from head of development, and now I'm head of technical product management. And as Vera was saying, uh, oh. are you? We had some issues with the slides. So, as Vera was saying, One and One Romania is part of the United Internet Group. The United Internet Group is a, a big multinational company with, uh, in Germany. We have three main uh, business directions. Uh, it's the One and One Access, which is the phone uh, company part with mobile phones, internet, and so on. Whoever is in Germany, they probably know about us. We are also on the Borussia Dortmund T-shirt. If you if you watch uh, soccer games, yeah. Uh, then we have IONOS, which is the biggest hosting company in Europe and the second in the world after GoDaddy. There we sell domains, we sell cloud, we do all of the things that uh, all the big hosting companies do. Uh, of course, more in, more in Germany and Europe than the US and uh, the other parts. But if you want domains or anything, you can go and try. We have excellent uh, prices. And then uh, Mail and Media. We are from Mail and Media. Me and Vera, we are representing the email uh, part of the group. So basically, the, the two biggest uh, email providers in Germany as brands, they are both uh, in our group, is GMX and WebDE. We are also present internationally with Mail.com. We have over 40 million customers. We are basically the European alternative. Or, uh, this, this is how we see ourselves, the European alternative of uh, Google and uh, Gmail and Yahoo and so on. So if you are interested in having your data in Europe, we are only uh, working with companies which uh, guarantee that the data stays in Europe. So if you are interested in GDPR, you can check us out. In terms of customers, I said we had around 40 million customers. Uh, we uh, mainly have email, but we also have uh, partners with uh, partnerships with other companies digital services, these uh, are two and so on, so mostly in the general market, but you could also uh, find it in the international market like Switzerland and uh, Austria. In terms of open source, we are a big company, so of course we are using open source, and it's not only about using, but also contributing to a lot of uh, 
uh, communities. We are members of different communities related to email abuse uh, and everything around email, of course, because they are that's for me business. But we are also part of LibreOffice. That's a, a great partnership for us. We are part of uh, security organizations like OWASP and so on. And, and by the way, one of the projects in OWASP, which is very dear to me, started in the media. It's called Security Rat, and it's a tool which helps uh, development teams to develop in a secure way, managing security requirements. It's free, you can check it out, you can contribute, just, just uh, try to do it. Regarding LibreOffice and our collaboration, we uh, are working together since 2018. Uh, we started with LibreOffice, then moved to Colabora. We integrated it in our portals, so all our customers who have a, a web space, a, a cloud space, they can use uh, the one I'm office as we call it as a product where we create documents, everything is based on LibreOffice. We have Gabi, which is uh, part of the community, part of the board of directors, and also of the steering committee for the engineering. We have also other people who are contributing actively, actively as developers. And in terms of uh, usage, if you are interested, we have pretty, I would say, significant numbers. We have around 330,000 unique customers per month. We have around 440,000 uh, open files and around 20,000 new created files per day. And this is all happening because of you guys and uh, because of this project and the collaboration that we have together. So uh, for me, it's really great to be part of this uh, conference and be part of this uh, community. Uh, of course, not only with the uh, Work. We are also contributing with the organization of the events and so on and so forth, and there I will tell you more about it. So, thank you. So, why, why did we volunteer to, to organize this? Uh, you know, in our uh, normal work time, uh, we are all engineers um, uh, or leaders or software architects or technical product managers uh, who are developing uh, different products like calendar, online office uh, for all our friends. Um, we wanted to, of course, contribute more besides the hands-on that our developers are doing for the community and Gabriel as well. Uh, we wanted to uh, help more, to, to give more. Uh, that was one of the motivations. The other motivation was also to bring the power of uh, engineering from Romania to TDF and the LibreOffice. So we wanted to show um, our country, um, which uh, probably you heard from, from Mihna. Uh, we are providing lots of engineers and uh, we have a big talent pool in Romania and Bucharest. Um, and we wanted to uh, let them know about your community, your great community, and uh, of course encourage them to, to contribute. Um, we are happy that in the workshop, uh, lots of students and engineers uh, uh, volunteer to, to participate. So, at least uh, uh, some few developers or QAs or uh, localization specialists uh, will gonna hopefully contribute from now on. Uh, to tell you a little bit about the organizing team, of course we wouldn't have been able to do this without uh, uh, Sophie, Italo, Mike, Hussein, they were all great and kind to us uh, because, of course, this was uh, the first time we, we did this. It was our first event. Uh, so they were uh, truly supporting us in, in all the challenges that, uh, that we had along the way. And we had a few. journey uh, because this way we learned about your culture, um, we learned about the beautiful people you are um, and uh, um, the fact that you're doing this to really bring uh, um, great software to the mankind. So um, um, in this organizing team uh, we had our leader uh, Idina, uh, she put uh, on her network skills and uh, she was really literally able to find um, 
supporters uh, in any issue we are we were having. So um, she connected us with the university, with the with the dean, with Mikna, um, as well with Rasman from Rosedo. Uh, we uh, she she tried to like find uh, uh, some helpers for any challenge we, we had. Of course, Gabriel was in the middle of everything. <laughs> he he was of course um, uh, part of he's of course part of the community since since a few years in us the community. So he was um, all the time you knowing getting into all the details of the organization as well, uh, keeping in touch with you guys. Um, our solution architect, uh, Catalin, we found out that he has the legal skills, so he can easily be a lawyer, <laughs> um, but we prefer him an architect. He definitely took care about the, the contracts and um, yeah, he definitely supported um, uh, with um, everything uh, uh, regarding this. Roberto uh, was the one uh, getting all the information about the visas, about uh, uh, the invitations, uh, of course, uh, solving lots of issues. Um, and uh, we also had the support from, from Adrian, uh, who created the, the beautiful logo. We also had the support of uh, Gabriel and Cosmin, who are, uh, um, and of course, the Daniel, who are also supporting with, uh, with the workshop. They are uh, acting as assistants in the workshop. Uh, so we are really, really grateful for this. Um, as mentioned, we already uh, met Mikna. Uh, we also have Razvan. Unfortunately, he couldn't uh, join us today due to the fact that uh, he, he's away, he's, uh, he's traveling. Uh, but he was really incredible. Uh, signing contracts in the middle of the night, uh, paying invoices uh, again in the middle of the night, and uh, organizing everything uh, um, uh, in the cloud. So we are all organized with, with contracts, invoices, and everything. So he was providing uh, uh, Rosted, uh, he represented Rosedu, who is the NGO who helped us in uh, organizing this beautiful event. And of course, Dan, who uh, connected us with, uh, with the university and supported the different, uh, different things. So, um, yeah, that's all from my side. Uh, again, thank you very much for uh, letting us organize this beautiful event. I hope you're going to enjoy it. In case of you need anything, just let us know. We are, we're going to be here. Um, get ready for tonight. We're going to have a nice, uh, a nice dinner uh, and also some Romanian dancing. So, I hope you, you're willing to learn uh, to dance Romanian <laughs> songs. Um, and of course, the hack fest, but I want to give Badita Alessa. So, thank you very much and have a beautiful time here.